Oh, you, <laughs> oh, you were the uncoolest lot in the whole room. You turned up first. Thanks, it's fun. <laughs> 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 Is it? Oh, you were the uncoolest lot in the whole room. You turned up first. So we can see, um, so we've got Barry on the screen. We're commentating on him doing some tokens because he's finally doing some work for a change. It's the only time you see it. <laughs> <laughs> uh, so we're just getting set up. So the room's just getting set up. We've got people turning up. Who do you want on the stream first? You, you just tell me and send someone over. Right, okay. Uh, we need, no, we need uh, uh, Holes, Adam Stevenson. Uh, which team is that? I don't know. Uh, it, uh, holes, 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 Angels, rookie mistakes. That's uh, versus Vagabond Prime. Yeah, Hells Angels, yeah. Was that Hell's yeah. Angels? Okay. Yeah, I think that's uh, John Cannon, <laughs> Adam Stevenson. Uh, I can't remember the other gentleman's name. That's terrible. Uh, Matt. Matt. Yeah. Don't worry, all the tables are actually regulation size. So if you haven't got a mat, it's not a massive problem. Don't worry. If you got it, if you got it, yeah, bring it. Oh, yeah, bring it. That'd be lovely. Just nice to play on. Yeah, yeah, and yeah. obviously, oh, obviously. These one, these tabletops are slippy as hell. So, yeah, me, clumsy me was playing yesterday and knocking everything over. Right, okay. Oh yeah, I'm definitely clumsy. I'm the worst. Morning, car. Okay, morning. My voice is um, <coughs> dying. That's Kai Taniguchi. That is, uh, sorry, Kai Taniguchi. He does all of the lit up ships, fully modded lighting. Holy yeah. crap! Well done, legend, dude. absolute legend. Um, okay, we're doing a interview camera as well, so I'll be over there interviewing in a minute and doing a few bit. There's Rob Cheshire there at the minute, so we'll interview him. No, you won't. Yeah, you, won't. you will. You're already on it, mate. Okay. <laughs> Your missus knows where you are now. <laughs> so yeah, so we'll get him on the screen. We'll go back to that, and just for the minute, we'll go back to um, the nice scrolly video.
This is my interview camera. Yeah, yeah. This is the live stream table. Yeah. to commentate his camera okay. when we go towards the game and they start setting up we go to that okay all right then are you putting the list up on the side Good morning, everybody. So we are live at the UKTC. Uh, this is uh, X-Wing 2.0. Uh, today, this is the first uh, team event for X-Wing 2.0 that we're being involved with. So if you meet that, so we know what we're doing. Yeah. So what we're going to do is going to drag a few people over and get them to interview. So basically, we've got Cloud City Sentinels. So we're going to get Rob Cheshire and Dave Ponting from Cloud City Sentinels to come over and say hello. Come on up along. He's a fairy cowboy. He's called Hopalong Sparkles. He's coming in a second. So just move, just move in, just move in, just move in, just move in. Just move in. There we go. So these are the Cloud City Sentinels for today. This is the two of the three. Yeah, the other one's on his way. You're, you're Rob Cheshire. Yeah, I am. And Dave Potty. Right. So we start with you. What are you flying? Uh, two Reapers on this one. So Dumperials. Yes. Okay. And you're flying um, an Arc 170, yeah. uh, X-Wing and uh, Y-Wing. Nice. Okay, so you've gone Dutch, Nora, uh, Luke. Dirty Luke, yeah. yeah Dutch Nora. Okay. Um, expectations for the day? Um, just enjoy it. Just have fun, fun and actually try and win again. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. 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 Last time I turned up here, I went 0 and 6, so anything better than 0 and 6. Oh, so, so 1 and 5 is going to be smooth. 1 and 5, and what do you think? What do you reckon? I think I did 2 and 5 last time. Okay, so we're looking at 3 and 3. And then you're just waiting on your scum player to turn up. Yeah. Alright, okay. Thank you very much for the day. Best of luck, obviously being Cloud City. Yeah, we'll try our best. We'll do our best. If, if you win this tournament, you're not Cloud City anymore, I'm afraid. Oh, right. <laughs> if we win? Yeah, if you win, that's it. No, sorry, can't be associated with you anymore. We're going to grab the Meeples Red guys. If they come over. Come on, gentlemen. Come and say hello to me. You know you want to. Come on, stop stalling. The other guy's not here, so he can't be involved. It's tough. Just come around, stand close to me. Like, like, like you actually like me. Okay. Right, okay. Just get you to stand over there. So, okay, what's your name? Uh, Craig Bradford. Okay, and? Uh, Chris Gowan. Right, okay, and you're flying today? Yeah. Okay. Brothers. I think you spelled it wrong. It's dumb here. <laughs> so, um, have you been to the UKTC before? Yeah, every time. Every year? Every year. So this is the fourth year. How have you done over the years? Fairly well. Fairly well? Right. Top four. Because before yeah. you, had, you had like a massive amount of meeples, didn't you? Yeah. You've got last three teams, you said. Five teams last yeah. year, there's three teams. Is the little guy, is it Zach? No, Zach. Oh, yeah. You would have come, but he's got, um, they've got a family thing this weekend. So. Okay, okay. Well, we'll let him off in this time. <laughs> okay, so, um, so how did you do last year? Fourth? No. Fifth? Somewhere around there. Fifth? So we're, in the, we're in the top. We're in the top. Actually, we're yeah. Yeah. Okay. So we're looking for an improvement, or just happy <laughs> to be. Happy? Oh, I was going to say. <laughs> we're very quite, we're I'm very <laughs> We have to excel all the time. Yeah, we're very quite competitive. <laughs> right. Okay. Okay. Now, um, how have you gone about building your lists? Considering two Bruno so so influential. I really wanted to fly Phantoms again, so I am really forcing. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. You're that guy. Okay, yeah. Well, that's pretty. That's not too bad, actually. Yeah, I don't know. Because they get this with you, don't they? Anyway, so they get to recloak if they keep the net. That's disgusting. Was a, there was a thread on the first time I ran it on Basel. There was a thread on the SFG forums. Ban it now. Later, oh, okay. Someone saying if, if, if Phantoms of Duke is busted, we really need to know. Yeah. And it's just like 
it, reading it, it's just like, this guy watched my game. <laughs> <laughs> this guy actually, I played that guy. I've ruined that guy. That poor guy. He, 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 he didn't, I didn't play him, but he, he's, uh, he was watching the game that I was playing that night. So it's just like, yeah. I, I, he's there were only about you've two ruined, games running. You've so ruined like, Phantoms for everything. Maybe. Yeah. It's alright, if they do make you more expensive. Or, it's <laughs> just run free, it's just because I don't really need the fourth one anyway. I can work in the name pilots, <laughs> get, get Vader crew in there. Yeah. I'll do some for it. just makes them better. That's it. But, but not better, that's what you need. Best of luck for today, <laughs> hopefully we do better. Yeah. And uh, we're not going to the trip. Thank you. Thank, Thank you very much. <laughs> right, okay, so we're scanning the room. We're going to get the man over. This man has rescued the UKTC in the background for the last couple of years, actually. This is Ian Russell. Now, he's the man that's doing all of the, the scoring. The scoring, and, yes. And, and uh, the, uh, making the occasional um, interesting judge call. Yes. Yeah. The so, correct judge call. So, we've, we've been with UKTC from the start. Not quite. I missed first year. Yeah. Um, and then Bradbury turned up in the second year to see if there was like anyone who got that really corrupted to do with points. Yeah. Um, and we've been doing it ever since. Yeah, that's it. See? So it's all good fun. It's probably you get too good at your job, everybody wants you to do it all the time. Well, yeah, it, it helps it run smoother. I mean, previously they were doing it on pen and paper and I was just so so, um, what are you looking forward to today? Are you looking forward to an unknown? Are you looking forward to a Cinderella story? Uh, I'm looking forward to not screwing up the scores. Okay, that, that would um, obviously be so right. So that's going to be a really good thing. Um, just a nice fun day. It's going to be a nice fun day. We can see what we can find. Well, it's we, know we say best of luck to all the players. I'm going to say best of luck to you because you're probably the main man in a minute. Um, try and drag someone over. Look, Marsha's coming over. Unfortunately, Marsha, you have to come on the camera. So, this is Marsha. You are quite a new player. So how long has it been? Two months. Two months. And you smashed it in your league after about a month and a half of killing everybody. And, yeah. and then you've come to the UKTC. Have you come with a team from Coventry? Yes. Yeah. Raised. Right, okay. Yeah. And what are you flying? I'm flying Imperials. Dumb Imperials. Everybody keeps saying it wrong. You mispronounce it. It's Dumb Imperials. <laughs> Sorry, that's my own personal bias. It's alright. Right, so what, what are in your squadron today? Um, I've got Rexler, Defender. Yeah. Yeah. Um, I've got a tie advanced uh, X1. Yeah. Which is me. Right, yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, I've got a name tie. Right. So, do you think that's the. I mean, looking at. I mean, I mean 2.0 is literally what? 3, 4 yeah. or something? Yeah. So, it's hard to gauge. There are good stuff. There is good stuff. Right? It's hard to gauge. Yeah. 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 It's hard to gauge. 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 It's have, have you practiced at all? I've practiced a lot. Yeah. 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 No, that is a that that message. Especially over such a big camp, you've got five or six games in front of you. You've got control. That nearly shifts. Yeah. The first UK TC, I just said, and said not to fire the field. By the end of the day, I'll just give out excellent and play anymore. Just burn me out. Well, all the best. Hopefully, your team does well today. And, uh, and uh, see you later. I'll be talking to you when you've got the winners' medals. Right, let's see if we can grab somebody and we'll see what we've got. Anybody. Well, I tell you what, to there's some more people here, we will cut it there and we will go to the you know, start screen.
Well, right, okay, so uh, we're back and we've got the man. Boba Fett is itchy here in person. <laughs> It's <laughs> Boba Fett. It is now. Pretty much, you can just take ownership. You, you've been, you've been in the Star Wars community longer than me. <laughs> I think I said more. <laughs> so, are we Boba Guru in it today? Of course. Yeah. Right. Okay. So you're the scum player of your team. I am the scum player. What's the team? Uh, so it's uh, the Team One X X podcast. Okay. Yeah. So you've got me, Ollie Popnall, and John Wolf. Right. Okay. Ollie's, that's quite, that's quite a ring of team. Ollie, Ollie's, Ollie's flying the imps, yeah. and John's flying the robots. Right. Well, it's <laughs> team. <laughs> There was a really conversation about who was flying scum. Right, okay. And I was like, no, you can't see that little thing. Do you want to fly a rebel? Yeah, yeah. So that doesn't work. Um, so, and anyway, I saw the other day we were talking about your podcast that you and the guy that won the Gold Squadron Classic have been talking and you've got a bit of a list together. Well, he, 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 I, well basically, I got sent a message. Yeah, I woke up to like three or four messages from people who I'd never spoken to before from the States. Just because you're the guy? Going, 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 how do you fly this guy was flying this list. And, and then, I, I flew your list and I won it. And um, that's just really cool. Yeah, um, yeah, it's nice to know that what you're obviously writing is effective. Yeah, yeah. and it's, it's great to hear about it doing well. I'm, yeah. I'm not sure the Gold Squadron guys are right, but they can have Yeah, yeah, yeah. They've yeah, obviously yeah. not tried yeah. flying it against more than three ships. Yes. <laughs> yeah. becomes, you know, once, yeah. once you put it through its paces, then you can decide. Yeah. We're three weeks into, a, into an edition. No, I'm, I'm, just, I'm just really happy that at least uh, I've loved I started flying it last Christmas. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then all of a sudden, they just think change the game to make it better for yeah, me. Like, I'm like, wait, this 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 guy looks like he needs some thank, help. Thank you, FFG, <laughs> for, for helping my list out. <laughs> exactly. Yeah. Um, so um, you came last year. I did come last yeah. year. Last year I was here with Zombie Squadron. Uh, I went four two. My team went three three. I think. Oh, nice. So so just looking for a little bit better than hopefully. Yeah. Um, if not. Well, I think I think that the, the joy of the joy of where we're at in two point oh is as if guys are finding out over in Coruscant. Yeah, not really knows what's no, good. No one knows. And and like we've got ideas that we think Fen Rao is pretty hot because yeah. lots of people running it. For yeah. Like, yeah. Like, all these things like people are seeing. Them, yeah. But I think I think it's just it's such an exciting point to be in the game. Yeah. Where it's a oh yeah, and, and of course today, with the list being produced on the day, no one's had any planning. Yeah. So they've like, not been able to go, oh, look, we'll look at that list and we'll go. So yeah. No, this is, you, as soon as you get to the table, you have to decide there and then yeah. what I mean, do you I, think you're I mean, doing. This is the right. seventh tournament in 2.0. Right. In four five minutes. Right. So hopefully, hopefully I've seen quite a lot on the tables to get a good idea of yeah. 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 Somebody Come and stand over here. Okay. <laughs> so, all squeeze in like you actually like me. You go around that way, you go around that way, you go around that way. Am I still in the screen? Yes. Okay, so we're here with Team Los Angeles. Right, okay. And we have. Johnny, Adam, Peter. Right, so I smashed you up yesterday. <laughs> so it's a bit silly against you yesterday. You got a lucky escape. Yes, so, um, you've got lucky escape. So, um, <laughs> so we, I've seen them, and they're all very, very scary. You're, you're changing. Oh, okay. He's got three fangs. Oh really? Have you gone that way? You've got <laughs> double fangs and <laughs> you and you're the three horrible bombers yeah. and the knobheads and their belts. Dumb periods. Yeah. You are a Jackson. <laughs> <laughs> um, did you come last No, no, no. This is the first end. You are literally... This year's luckier than ever because the games have been out obviously what, three, four weeks? Always before the list were generated four weeks before the <laughs> so people had chance to plan what the matchups were going to be and all that kind of stuff. You guys have the luxury where you're literally coming in like a normal tournament. Look at all the judges and 
Right, let's see who else we've got. Uh, we should be able to call in. Hello, mate, you alright? Let's see if we can call in. Mr. Townsend! Okay, so we've got Luke Townsend. I don't know if you know about Luke Townsend, but he is. A uh, truly sexy guy, uh, sorry, um, nice guy. Chris Davis is here with me. So, this is your national champion. <laughs> Not too bad. Who are you playing for today? Crimson Aces. Crimson Aces. Right. Okay, and what's the team name? Oh, okay. You team I'm captain? No, no, no. I was no, going to no, say. No, no, no. no, no. <laughs> what is bugging it? I'm about as well as it makes. Right, okay. So, are you the rebel player today? Oh, really? I must admit, I saw it going yesterday, and I was like, oh, that's pretty good. <laughs> but, <laughs> for extra, just for extra, I only had three games before. But I mean, ever since I've been, I've been to extra, lots of extra, because every now and then you dabble in something else. Yeah, majority of the time you come. <laughs> so, we, you were my team captain in the first year. That's four years. So we didn't do, we didn't do too well. You won all of your games. You won a true one. Liam. Oh, oh, that's good. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, but the rest of us kind of did. Me and Marie sort of let you know what we kind of did when we did. Um, so, uh, any questions today? Are you just having a lot of fun? Or do you think it's just taking a lot of fun? What do you think of the list for the day? I kind of like it, but I kind of don't. I know there's a little bit of a control freak in all of us. Yeah, yeah, that's it. We do. We like to have a little bit of control. Yeah, you like Spritchy. But we were like, I remember the first year we were like, whatever, yeah, whatever. I was like, yeah, I don't know my son's game. You know, yeah, you play, yeah, I was like, which one do you want? I mean, the list of the game I love it. And there are some list of that are already And if you were sitting across the table, what would you like to think of? If you were picking, if you said like Boba Gori, you've got like um, a Tice Horn, you've got um, like a million pieces, honestly. No, it's just me defending because the upgrade went down. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, no, I was, I'd rather just smash some nukes today if that's okay. <laughs> no, no, no. Yeah. Right, well, best of luck. Everyone goes well. I'm going to comment and speak into the mic. I think when you're putting your next decision, you're not. Know. It's also my voice, which is a bit shit. They might know, I think it's not about the other people. Oh, it's me talking. Oh, okay, sorry. Apologies. Might be that. Apologies. <laughs> Everybody hates me. Everybody hates me. Yeah. Yes. You alright? Uh, David Rob, I was like. Uh, He's got his, he's got crutches. Oh. <laughs> Do you know, I don't know. Get me back in a minute. There's Rob. Rob. That's Adam, your teammate. Hi. 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 They're there. Right, okay, so we will try and grab some other people as we walk in around. Anybody wants to see Maybe just become a What we'll do, we'll cut it there, and when we get some more people over, we'll line them up and get some interviews with them.
Right, come in. You're gonna have to come in. Right, we're back at the UKTC. Oh my god, I'm gonna stab him in a minute. Back. Oh. Right. Yeah. Oh. Right. Creep in, creep in. Look, there's the screen. You need to be on it. Yeah. Okay, so I'm here with Weekend Warlords. Well, we've got with, with, with a Baron, a Renegade, and a Hunter. Ooh. Yeah, so. <laughs> <laughs> the Baron. Oh, okay. Why oh, does it work? Who's Renegade? Don't. Okay, so what is in your list? Oh, right. Oh, about to tell you. Well, oh, yeah. Rex, Rex, that like Whisper, and Nightmare. Whisper. Whisper. Yeah, I was going to say, you know this is a friendly team tour. Yeah. I've been very, very friendly. Yeah, yeah very friendly. Yeah, very friendly. Yeah, very friendly. Yeah. 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 Personal, yeah. exactly. Bob Gurry. Oh, Bob Gurry. Bob Gurry. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Bob Gurry. 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 Yeah, that's what it's good as well. We've got a John Kelly, Jim 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 so, so how have you done when you've been coming? Uh, it's not the same. Like, first year, first year we we finished up being a table. I'd only been playing probably about six months, if that. Uh, I know that's no excuse because there's a player in the market. She smashed the local things. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. yeah. Well, I did something really. I, 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 I was quite well this season. Yeah. Went to two events, made a couple of videos, and then I just put it on the net. Just, 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 Right, I'm back, and I've got the man, the the cape, the legend. Oh my God, Kate Meta, so you're going to be bottom tables? Oh no! So we're just what we're doing is we're just doing a little bit of fun. We come down to the sort of play, see what the team is doing. So you're also doing something quite special at the moment because the dog. Yeah, I'm doing a weight loss challenge. So we're both kicking in for the start of the weight loss challenge. 
Absolute legend, pass me those here. So Rory's just brought me over the stuff. We've got the UKTC, nice tray, nice mat, and the Cloud City ones as well. You are an absolute star. If anybody out there wants uh, lit ships or mouse mats or anything to do with buying Star Wars or anything like that, do a CK, fully modded lighting. Uh, he should be on the X Wing uh, uh, mods and retakes page. Go and see him, He's an absolute legend. Great, great, uh, customer service. Right. So, yeah, go on over there. Who have we got? If one person turns around and spots the mic, then they come and talk to me. Hello, how are you? And your name is? I know, but they go. Right, okay, and what are you doing today? I've got three in the centres. Things have changed. Okay, and your name is? 
plug in. Now, if you have listened to the podcast, come around a little bit more so we can see you. Alberto is the man that did the rain thing to me. <laughs> we had this massive discussion beforehand. Don't park in the front of Ray. And I parked all four of my ships in the front of Ray. In which he decided to then You're just right. leave the ship as well. <laughs> so, yeah, thank you. This is your first experience with the UKTC as a team. Who's the team captain? Yeah? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> that is, I was going to say, that's the worst position because it's always going to be your fault. So no matter who these guys pick or who you pick them to play, if they win, lose, or draw, you're going to be, they have this fight, you know? <laughs> So you're doomed for the rest of the day. So, uh, so yeah, what are you going to play? Uh, me, I'm playing you. You. One, two, three. I've had to give myself a lot of Oh, okay, fucking brilliant. Brilliant. That's I thought that was yesterday. It's, it's bananas. Because you get to watch me of all of the dials, they all do different stuff. So you every other one. So you can Yeah, so did you? Yeah, 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 thank you very much, that's awesome. Uh, so, uh, right, come in so we can see you. Come around, come around, come around. What are you actually like? <laughs> <laughs> so I am joined by... Uh, Chris Maddock. And your team is called? Tintinacy. is number one first brilliant ex Yeah. Pop up. I love it. And you're all in today. Uh, scum. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, 
So this is George Delapina, Rasta. So you are a former European champion. Thank you. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Has been. Has been. So, um, Nick, you so you've won the last two years. Yeah. We ain't got a chance this year. We no. haven't played any 2.0. Or practice, or should be strict like this to you? Yeah, well, you know, I'm not playing, you know. <laughs> <laughs> so, that's again, I'm so not a fan of the commentator. No, you're not the one. I'm like, if we come like bottom third, I'll be at the end. Oh, gotcha. Yeah, yeah. 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 No, that's it, absolutely. So, so, so how's the new fans? I've got the new controls as well. I was going to say, fuck me, anybody you know, you're probably going to smash it, even with that. I reckon I'll win a couple, I'd be alright. I'll see you later. Okay, well we'll stop it there for a second. I, I need to have a drink because my voice is dying.
Right, I am back. So, we're at Spirelli going through little breaks and things like that with lots of people turning up. I mean, you've got 130 or players here today? Something like that. It's 46, 48 teams, 50, nearly 50 teams, I think. And uh, they're all cracking in, everybody's coming in. I'm talking to myself, hopefully. Oh my god, look, there's, there's Ian with my prizes. So, let's so, there's, there's a lot of you. So you've got the uh, two sections of prizes. Now, I'm going to tell you, nobody wants that rubbish there. They all want the templates of tears. Everybody wants the template. Oh, nice. oh, nice. oh, nice. oh, nice. You just had things arrive, you just had the ship to arrive. <laughs> I think we've got the best team ever to turn up. Yeah, 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 yeah. They're registering now, and yeah, we'll definitely get them. How's it going though? Registration tools are still waiting Stay tuned, everybody. Yeah, I'll see you Yeah, best of luck. Um, so through the day we will obviously have chats with um, Ian, have see how things are going on. We'd normally see like he, the, uh, the uh, Ian who's done all the scores, we'd, uh, we'll get, grab a judge and get him over and see if we can give us uh, an update on how things are going throughout the day. Um, I, need to, uh, I need to grab a couple of people. Salty, Salty, half on Seb. Oh here we go. You come, you come over anyway. Sorry. Look at this! <laughs> this is amazing! This was just born out of the first year. Yeah. I was playing, playing against our party and Seth from walking around and just like make out this one. And they put on the top of the music in the background yeah, yeah. and they just went from there. I mean, all the Yeah, this is all like pop movement put on whilst wearing it. It was awesome. You really need to get half on and stuff. So. <laughs> oh no, and, and here's the man here in the <laughs> Even the swaggers there as well, though. You know, you know they say sometimes about pod players, they just live their role. You are a maverick. So you're not going to be a Because he said was that. Yeah, he is. Thank <laughs> you. 
we get the boring stuff out of the way. If there's fire, we then exit out the doors of the front of the hotel, assemble under the underpasses. Um, there's also fire exits at the rear of the room as well. Um, it's up to you whether you want to stay and burn and collect all your stuff before you go out. <laughs> Um, we're still missing one team. I can't believe it's not Bantha. Are they in the room? That'll be a no. Uh, okay. In that case, free money. Uh, I'm your host today, so I'm Mandalorian. We've got Cloud City doing the streaming with Lebo Williams and uh, Reese Two D Two. We've got the Grand Moff. Who's <laughs> <laughs> judging today? So if you've got a lot of judging, we've got a chicken hearts. So come and see us. If you've got a problem, shout loud. If you've got a problem, we want to sort that out. Uh, if anybody's got a problem, just, just see us. Everybody's quite nice and friendly today. So uh, let's just enjoy ourselves. So uh, we've got a couple of minutes before we actually start. Um, people have got, got schedules up everywhere, so you don't have to keep coming and asking us what time things are starting, all right? So I'll give you the heads up in a minute when we're about to start. Live. We should have had this a little bit earlier. Hello, mate. You alright? Let's have a look. So we, uh, yeah, get in there. We've got to get this all sorted now. Uh, look, instinctive aim. Proton. Yes, buddy. Yeah, I'll come and say hello. Oh, nice. That's a nice one. Oh, do you want to get your microphone over onto your table? Just un unconnect the bottom of it. And then we've got. Wait, 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 the camera's... <laughs> wait, wait, it's alright. There we go. Back up live now. Uh, why are we... Dutch is really good. Now Dutch is really good, but I mean he's not flying in with a turret, he's flying in with protons. Which is pretty pretty legit. Oh uh, yeah, I, I know it. I played it yesterday. Uh, No, 
nice bait. We are we are going to get this thing out. So we've got Boba Fett. Uh, Boba Fett has uh, Han Gunner. So we put the title on Marauder. Gives him a Gunner with Han and Perceptive Copilot. And then he's got two Skull Squadrons with marksmanship. Right, we're, ju we're literally just working on getting the uh, overlay up and running. And there we go, right, so I need to dock to that a little bit. So we do that, take that out, get them all sorted. So A little bit bigger. Right. Yeah. I've already done it. Oh, if you just send it to. Yeah, I've took the photos of them. Do you want to, do you want to send them to uh, Cloud City? Just send it to me and I'll put them up on Cloud City. Oh, yeah, no, just send them and I can put them on, yeah. Just send it. Sorry guys, just literally playing with it a little bit just to make sure it all fits. 
probably just a little bit more. And that is it. So out there, as you can see, as you can see, we have up on screen at the moment, we had Adam Stevenson from the Hulls Angels. We also have um, Alfie Bristol. Uh, I don't know. Do you know what? I don't know the other Nick team. Do you find out the team? What the team is called? Yeah, Adam, Adam. Adam is. It's a lovely old boy. I played him yesterday. I played this left yesterday. Right. Let's uh, start the time up. I think they've already started a little bit, so there will be a couple of minutes difference. But we'll be back on it in a second. Yeah. See, look, they're already there. Look, they're already. Do you want to give that back to Alfred? Hang on, what's his name? Andy. 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 Why have I put Alfie? <laughs> Sent the usual cool, cheers mate. <laughs> okay, here we go. So, what we need is we need... We need it like that. So you can see, so as you can see, the fangs have come in hard. The fangs have proper come in hard. They're proper looking for, a, 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 this, is, this was his tactic yesterday against me. So um, I was pretty much flying uh, a bit of everything. So I had a B wing, um, I had A wing, Y wing, X wing. And of course, we actually killed each other's ship in the last turn, but this was, he was very aggressive, very aggressive flying him. Um, making sure that he was uh, getting, making sure he could, he could literally get his uh, his cover. Turn that, turn that right down. Now, those over there in Twitchland, if you could tell me how the audio is going, because we don't want to be too loud, but obviously we need you to hear everything that's going on. Um, we need, yeah, we need, we need you to see how it's going along. Okay, thank you very much for those uh, for those bits there. That's amazing. Uh, if you do want to subscribe to the channel, you can subscribe with your Twitch Prime. So uh, you can get some streaming X Wings, some fun games. We we like to do a little bit. Oh, look at that! Look, Boba's coming in hard. Okay, so let's uh, let's turn it down a little bit. How's that? How's that? Is that any better? Because obviously we don't want to sort of like blast your ears off. We want to make sure that you can hear everything we're saying. Um, if we keep it away from the mic. So look at that. Look, Boba is literally jousting. He's had, he's had enough. He's gonna I think I think what he's trying to do is shut down the torpedoes. But obviously, he's still getting four dice, three dice. You know, it's going to be bad. I think, and also. Especially two of them target locked them. Target well, focus. Wedge is Wedge is pilot skill six. So Wedge is the, the X wing on the back there. So X wing uh, Wedge is going to be in range for proton torpedoes. Oh. So obviously, and he's reducing the agility. So you're talking four dice into a one agility fire spray, which is going to be amazing, amazing, amazing. Thank you very much, guys, for your help on the on the on the on the stream. Um, obviously, we don't want to we don't want to hurt you. Um. Let's have a look. Let's have a look. You say that, I didn't even check it. Hundred and eighty five. Hundred and eighty five points. There must be something else in there. Have a look, see if there's an astromech or something, because Sorry, I might have not done that right. But from when I saw it I was putting it in. But yeah, fifteen point bid is a bit much. There must be astromechs in there or something. That's me rushing, not getting it right. Well spotted, well spotted out there. That's it. Oh no, 185 points. No, yeah, he's running a 15 point bid. That's uh, okay, okay. <laughs> I mean, uh, I'm not sure with with Dutch. If if you've got if you've got the R3, R3 allows you to take two target locks. So with Dutch taking a target lock, he takes two, hands one off, and, but they have to target lock one of your target lock ship. So because Dutch has got two, it opens him up that he can go. Okay, yeah, cool. I've, I've got the luxury I can shoot that ship or that ship. Yeah. You know. Yeah. It's a quite a good combination. Dutch is broken in 2.0. Yeah, I suppose Bobber is... I mean, he's going to get his re-rolls in that, but... So he's going to use his target lock. For four. Uh, the bigger... The thing you have on the overlay is... Only 175 points. 785 on the thing. 
Oh, that's a bit weird because it says under no, eight. No, 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 no. That is literally just me and another comment. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> Okay, as much as I love you, dude, don't scare me. Also, I've got to resize that screen. I'm wondering whether to swap these over. May have to play a bit a bit more, I'm afraid. Sorry guys. It's proper cutting it off. I don't understand why it's cutting it off there. Perhaps I need to minimize the uh, player names. Let's have a look. Let's have a look, see if we can resize it. Ship upgrades. See if that fits in a bit better. Is that any better? Yeah, that's better. Yeah, see, there we go. It's brought in the points. Just need to and then, yeah, just reposition it back over there. Hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. Perfect. Look at that. It's like it was meant to be. <laughs> oh, my God. Evades. So, what we're going to need you to do is stand near the table and tell me what damage is going in. Yes. So, Bubba's taking all of his shields, he's down to two, uh, to, and he's taking two damage. Okay. Luke's taking all of his shields, he's got, taken two damage, one's a crit, blinded pilot. Oh, well he's alright because he's got force. So the blinded pilot's new, you can still attack. Yeah, I know, but, but you have to use, a in the first yeah, one. oh god, yeah. Yeah, that is, that is harsh. So above all the shields and then two damage, yeah? Yeah. Sorry. I'll have to keep on going over there after the shooting phases. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, and so to, 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 yeah, well, to be fair at the moment, obviously half points on Bubba is a big thing because he's 97 points. Because the beauty of everything now is everything gives half points. Mm. So you're shooting the little ships that used to be your point sinks. That's so like a, a you know, hundred point rebel build used to be like one ship that would take everything, be alive at the end of the game, and still hold all of the points you put into it. Suiting fell for the Imperials. Suiting fell for the Imperials. It's impossible. Never, be, never. It. You know, it'd always be on one hull and it'd now always be flying taking, around. Now, if you're taking half points, is it half points when you damage it? So you get you take it down to half health, half points. But if you're looking at if you're looking at what the um, what the uh, FFG are doing, they're still rounding up. So it's like, ah, oh, okay. Nothing, nothing on, nothing on any of them. No Astromex on any of his ships. It's crazy, crazy. I think I'm not sure a bid's worth it. In this day and age, I'm not sure a bid's worth it. I think you, for me, if I'm only running three ships, I want to make them the best they possibly can. Oh yeah. So I max out, like Dutch, Dutch. There's no turret. There's no turret. You know, proton torpedoes, yes, they're legit. Yes, you're taking target locks. Yes, you're giving a target lock away. If you've got two, it makes his front arc easier to find the target. So. Should we go back to the Twitch so, at the moment, basically, I am dying of man flu. I've given it to Reese because we were, Reese 2D2, because we were streaming Shade Spire all day yesterday. Yeah, so I feel like death this morning. Yeah, Adam, I think Adam's in a good position where he's going to like his odds here. Because right now, obviously, he's either got, you know, his hard turns to the left or right with his rear arc, and his fangs are closing. So his fangs can do quite a bit of damage, whether they're blocking or whether they're, um, you know, shooting. So I think, I think at this stage, Adam might be on a on a on a upward yeah, climb. I'd use 
the colourful one to get in beside Bubba, so when they move in, you're trying to block and this one to kind of get a ship. Yeah, yeah, you've only got to block the first ship and the other ones block mm. and don't get their actions, do they? And then what would you do with Bubba? I'll try and swing him to the left so you can still shoot. You can still shoot at the roof, can't you? Yeah. So if you swing him left, try and keep him in range one of them so you still get your re-rolls. Yeah. Yeah, it's not, it's not a bad so plan. You can block that way, and then this one blocks here. So if they do go just straight, you've still got shots on. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's, it's not it's not a bad plan. I mean, I mean, at the moment, if, I mean, if you're if you're the rebel guy here, you, you're kind of like thinking K-turn or bust if you've still got your target locks. But it doesn't look like he's got his target locks. No, it's spent Yeah, supernatural reflexes is like an advanced sensor to force users. You can spend charges to like do barrel rolls and stuff like that. It depended on whether his wings are open or closed. If they're closed when he's firing his torpedoes, then he gets to do a boost. He spends a charge, does a boost before he does anything else. Now, on a lot of ships, you've got these linked actions. So you can boost and link action, then do your blue manoeuvre, get rid of your stress from your red action, and then do what you need to do at the end of it. You can have three actions a turn. Yeah. Jeez. In this in this game of limited actions, supernatural reflexes is a thing. I'm surprised that well, I'm, yeah, I'm very Vader gets to spend all of his tokens when he's doing actions. He can just keep spending his force charges to do actions if he wants to. Yeah, but to be fair, he's Vader. He's always been. Yeah, and he's the points as well. He's like he's like near enough a hundred points when you tour him up. Probably that's more. Good, that's good about half points then, because if you had him at the end of the game where you're a hundred points, it's them dumperials though. I just can't do it. I just can't do it. So he's he's aiming for the block. If not, then he's aiming for the bump. The the you know being able to get to keep shots on. Thanks, mate. So we've got so many X-wing players in this room at the moment. I mean, who needs Coruscant? Coruscant's going on at the headquarters FFG. Who needs Coruscant? We've got the UK TC, dude. All the top players are here. Kind of. <laughs> Some of them. Now and then. We've got the world champion here. We've got the old European champion. We've got the new European champion. We have got the Top Gun team. If you go over to Cloud City Radio page, you will see Seb Brady, Salty Mills, and Afron. They are. They have come dressed up today as absolute legends. That's the extra mile. That they. Is. They are Maverick, Goose, and Iceman. I'm not even joking. Go to Cloud City Radio page and have a look. Um, they do look proper, proper good, proper legit. So here we go. I think it's K Turn Galore. No. See, now you wish you put on turret. Turret, because then you can still shoot. I mean, there's points there as well. This, you know, that's a big bid. Whether he's done it for his team, he spread them out absolutely lovely. Because, because the way, the way, the way that um, the UKTC works is obviously, you're, it's it's not a 200 point list. It's a 600 point team. Mm. So if you take from here and give to there, you can have two max teams as long as you've got one team that's like sacrificed a little bit to make sure you've got a bid going through. See, with over there, would you just go one forward to bump? To nah, I, see, I, I, I would have, I would have edged it. Oh. Yeah, that's what I was going to say. I would have edged it in hard turn left. Yeah. Much Look, sprays mm. on a medium base are a thing of beauty as well. Okay. They're medium bases, they're not large bases anymore. Same as a U wing, thing is a K wing, arc, 170, yeah, level, they've medium. all gone up We've said that to medium. Before, though, yeah. We? yeah. They're, they're too big a ship, too much hole and stuff like that. Yeah, I, I, I don't know if you know, but Cloud City, you know, we, we, we sort of let, let them have all their ideas. That's just yeah, and it's a oh, talent roll. Nice. Wow, great move. I didn't call that one. <laughs> I did not call that one. That is a legit move. Now, talent, red. It's red. Doesn't matter, though. Who's that on? Luke? That's on Luke. Because he could use his force charges to amend his dice. 4K. Okay. Oh. Bob, uh, Bob was going to get... That is. That is. Oh, well, you won't see Bob now because he can't shoot anything. It's got no arcs. So Bob is relying on re-rolls and keeping alive. But it's going to be hard when you've got, got three ships in you've got range you've one. got wedge wedge with a target lock. Oh, right. He's going to be range one, so he's got one agility, one re-roll. That is brutal. So we may see a dead Bobber on the first shot here. That was amazing. That was lovely flying. That, that was that was superb. So target lock. It's not looking good. Bobber might be dead there. 
Bubba might be dead. He's uh, uh, it's, it's just pulled off the move of Century. Talon rolled that Luke to there, and then 4K wedge to there. Look. Yeah, Bob's got re-rolls all day, all day. He loves it all day. Saves two. We might be seeing some damage. Two, three, four, five. That may be a dead Bobber. Bobber was still. Yeah, Bobber's dead. Ah, Bobber's down. These these fangs have got a massive tall ask now to get around that. Yeah, I don't want to put it on here. Glad you took it off when you put the pin in. I wanted to see you shove them. All of a sudden, my left eye turns. We've just received our pin badges for uh, UKTC. Now, we've both got four. Yeah, we've both got four. We've been here every day, every day of every UKTC. We'll do it again next year, won't we, if they want one? That's it. That's it. So, so what do you do here? You, you, you know, the fangs have got to try and start putting damage in. Oh, no. That's damage going in. I think that was Wedge losing shields. Yeah, yeah, I mean, I'm not even joking. You knew, I mean, when, when you saw where... Luke's just got free Oh, no actions, okay. He's got baloney by the... Yeah. So, is he concentrating on Luke's? So it's just the one damage. Wedge is still fully elfed. Fully off, yeah? yeah. So Luke might buy the dust here just for the simple fact that his blue moves here, he's got uh, one forward, one banks, two forward, three forward, I think. The Maybe the two banks as well. Right behind him, he's gonna struggle, man. Yeah. Oh, yeah. That's they are quick chips, aren't they? Fang fighters are fast. Problem is, they're, they're susceptible. So, like yesterday, um, I took one out with a Y wing at range three through a roid. He rolled, but he blanked out, and it was hit, hit, crit, and it was direct hit. Oh. So it was like one just popped, and that's a Y wing with trick shot range three. Five dice, he blanked out. But me and Adam ended on final salvo yesterday. So his last fang fighter killed my A wing, Jake Farrell. I killed him. He killed me, and it was like, oh. We've got, how many dice have we got? So we've got, like, I've got three on my X wing, I've got three on my B wing, I've got two on my Y wing, and I've got two on my A wing. So I've got ten. And he's like, well, I've got nine. Oh. And I've rolled ten, I've got five hits, he rolled his nine, I've got four. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, that's it. So predictions for the game now. Do you reckon Adam's going to pull this round with his fang fires? I mean, they're both fully elfed and they can, they can do their tricks, but the problem is that they need their actions to I think be. He needed Luke to go down that round. Yeah, yeah. Give him a little bit of... Uh, what we'll do is I'll send Reese and just give him a quick uh, have a look. Go and have a look how John and uh, Peter are doing. They're the next two tables, yeah? John's, uh, John's the sexy bald one. <laughs> John's the sexy bald one. <laughs> when he watches that back, he's going to laugh. Now, remember, guys, if you have got a Twitch Prime subscription, or sorry, an Amazon Prime subscription, you can log into one of your favorite streamers or favorite channel, Star Wars channels, and you can uh, click the subscribe button and use your Amazon Prime, Twitch Prime subscribe um, to basically subscribe to your channel. What it does is it's free money. You get it free for being an Amazon Prime um, customer, and uh, you get one subscription per month. Now, you can basically just log in, link your Amazon account, send over your subscription to any uh, any streamer that you follow 
and uh, it gives them a few pennies at the end of the day that they can actually use to make their stream better basically you know get us more equipment or get us to more locations pays the petrol pays the parking that kind of thing so white wings just going one forward now i'm not sure if white wings waiting to reposition so you said the sexy ball guy yeah he's taking out two tie fighters at six and he's changed his list from yesterday yeah he did yeah he did say he's two changed his list seven. yeah and he goes, there's no regen or no defence here, but going forward, it just starts. Just pop, smash. Pop, pop. But he's only taken one shield off of all three. He's only had one shield taken off of three. Which nice. So he's like, he's taken out two TIE fighters of six. Yeah. Nice. I think quite well. Nice. And um, the other guy seemed to, it seemed to be even, no damage on either side. Okay. Okay, okay. Yeah, because Peter's very methodical. I played Peter yesterday. He's very... He put two proton bombs down and I landed all four of my ships on both the proton bombs. That's not good. <laughs> it wasn't good. Yeah, I, I'm gonna be. I'm gonna be honest with you. If they can kill Luke, and there's no, and they are still both alive, maybe fully healthed. If they can, it's gonna be hard. But if they can, then I think Adam's got a chance. If he can get rid of that Luke, then it's Wedge and Dutch. And the thing with Dutch is he's not got a turret, so he has to face front arc. And the Y wing doll is not that forgiving. What do you mean, Johnny? Yeah, Johnny's struggled um, writing lists, so he stole everybody else's. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, is he leaving that net? Yeah, looks like it. One of those ships. Yeah, look, wedges, wedges crashed. Oh, so he's going to be shooting the back. So one. he'll be shooting about one, and line. it will be. Uh, it, yeah, because Dutch would have just one forward and made sure he stayed in range to give his target locks away. And then, so you've got four against two with a target lock. That's four hits. That's four hits. So he gets uh, he gets the uh, the Concord and then spends his focus for two. So he's definitely taking some damage. Right. So what we'll do? Top one is the painted one, and bottom one is the um, standard. Hitting a crit, blinded pilot. So he cannot, because he, he's got no force charges, he cannot amend his. That's brutal, especially when he's range one at Yeah. So bottom one's a painted one. So Two hits. It's quite harsh. Double of V. Two hits. No. That spend no, because he can spend his force. He needs. He needs to do it. Yeah. He needs to do it. So one, two. Yeah, that'll be that'll be a dead Luke, I should think. Shouldn't you have blinding pilot? Huh? We just got blinding pilot, didn't we? <laughs> Not that one. Like both of them just yeah, shot. but no, the blinding pilot you can still fire. You just you can only modify your dice with force. Oh, yeah. I yeah, yeah, yeah. So Luke has gone. So. Changed, yeah. Yeah, oh, yeah, in a big know, way. Yeah, yeah, that's in a big um, way. Yeah. Do you know what? The best thing to do. What are you looking for? Cards uh, are there. Underneath. No, it was a clear box with all my movement holes. Got a wave. Wait, this was the uh, release event. So that was the release event damage deck. There's some harsh ones in there. Panic pilot. Panic pilot gives you two stress tokens. So if you're Thane Corral in the new X-wing, yeah, mm. he gets to look at all of your damage cards and pick one and flip it up for the spend of one of his dice. So if he rolls a blank, I think it's a focus or a hit. You can spend a focus. Oh, panic pilot. All right, flip that up. Oh, double damage. Flip that up. Yeah, absolutely brutal. 
Wedge next, yeah. yeah. Uncle Bubba, you're gonna you're gonna be like sitting there like praying like come on, come on. Yeah, because I think I think at the moment Dutch Dutch will obviously give him target locks. Um, he's got to do a 4K or he's got to do a talent roll to try and get him out of there. So uh, that fan goes to block, the other one goes to shoot. But the problem is, oh, two talent roll, nice, nice. That's a nice move. The only problem is with having no, you know, with blinded pilot. Obviously, you're never going to mind your dice anyway. You're literally just getting in position so you can keep rolling dice. Uh, if this one does a K, because it would have blocked the four, hopefully. You can see Hulls Angels running the Nerf Herder tournament this year. It's up in Stockport. First Earth are going to be live streaming it. It's going to be a massive, massive event. Oh, we've got 4K from Dutch. No target locks. No target locks. So that means either Wedge is running or he's just going to edge his bets and just roll dice and see what happens for a turn. Well, no, if it's veg Wedge just goes a little if one it, forward. If, well, the thing is, he can either go one forward because he knows that the guys are running, but he's hard to, and I think that's a ball. Oh, that might be a bump, it might not. It might be a fit, actually. No, it's a bump. No, it's a fit. Fit. A fit, yeah? Nice. That was, that was, uh... yes, yes, K, we're going to be at Nerf Herder. We're playing. So there's me, there's a guy called Ryan Toon, there's uh, Mandalorian, and there's also uh, Pr Hop Along Sparkles as well. One of our teammates is coming along. Um, and so we've got, four, we've got Cloud City there in strength to play. We'll be around the bottom tables, making all you, you everybody else look good. How well they're defeating us. <laughs> but first off, we'll be there and they will be streaming. So you will get your games live. So. Oh, and we got target lock. So Concordia, but he's still taking damage. I think that, yeah, that may be that Fang Fighter gone. Oh no, Fang Fighter gone. So it's just the one Fang Fighter. I, I, th yeah, I'm gonna put, I'm gonna put. If I, I'm not even joking, if you've got any sort of like. Aces against the Fang Fire. The Fang Fire is good, just not that good. And unfortunately, unfortunately, with Wedge reducing Jilly, the Fang Fighters tend to enjoy having the free agility and a token. If you've not got any tokens, you could roll. Yes, they get to change one of their dice to an evade for Concordia if you're in each other's arcs at range one. They're a bit too fragile. Boba's the tank. Boba's the one that's supposed to come in and smash it up and just enjoy it. But Look at that, look, I've still got set, look at, oh, that's just, that is unforgivable. I've still got Saturday X-Wing 2.0 on the. Oh, terrible, should be fired. Nice, there we go. So point standing at the moment. I mean, he scored 73. He's target locked. Uh, he's target locked the rock because then he gives a target lock to um, yeah, Wedge. Rock. Yeah. Because you can attack him with rocks if you want to. He's going to have What? Yeah, you can target lock rocks. It's just... <laughs> there's a few pilots in the game where, uh, like Kira from the Solo movie, yeah, you yeah. can target lock a rock and you can spend that target lock to ignore it. So, you can, if oh, you, so if you fly over it or land on it, you can ignore it. Oh, okay. I think he's just done it because he can do it. <laughs> I'm going to target along that rock. What for? No reason. I'm going to target along. I'm going to target along that rock. Yeah. 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 Along that rock. <laughs> yeah, I mean, I mean, you know, we did say before. I mean, it, it, he's running now. The problem is. He's going to get caught, and he's going to get caught by both, and it's it's never going to be good. 
what would you do try and do turn around and have a shot to try and take Look, shields off one to get for me the, for me the, well, for me this game is over yeah so I would kam- I, I would kamikaze my rainbow love boat and just stick it straight into one of them ships if he takes if he takes his shields off the ducks would he get half points yeah so I'll just do that yeah, try and get. Well, no, no, no. He, he has to. He has to. He has to get taken down to half health. But I think the threshold on Dutch is like, uh, it's like five. So if he gets him down to five, he gets half points. So he's, he's, he does three damage. Because the MOV counts for tiebreakers. If if the whole Angels guys go on and storm the rest of it and have a stellar rest of the tournament, the MOV will come into play. So you just go down there and try and throw that down Sammy's throat. I'll just go after Dutch. Because I think Dutch is a four. Yeah, yeah. Dutch is a four. So, you shoot the same so time. if you don't get killed by Wedge, you're going to be shooting at the same time as Dutch, try and do some damage to him. I mean, even it all, what you do is you bump Wedge and concentrate on Dutch. Because Wedge has not got a shot, he's not going to be as harmful. Five forward. Five forward. Just, just go for it. <laughs> get in there. But I mean, the Rebel guy's going to be like, I'm going to do one forward. Oh no. <laughs> yeah. So they don't feel left out. Of yeah. <laughs> yeah, pretty much. Cookie. I'll I'll have a morning cookie. <laughs> morning. You have to excuse me, sorry. We are suffering from man flu. It's yeah. a legit thing. It's a legit thing. Yeah, and of course... On I'm going to be dead up in. Yeah. And of course, you know, me being me can't keep my gob shut. Oh, okay. Wedge. wedge is a lot of points. Wedge is 60 points. So we get 30 out of, if 30 out of Wedge. And if Wedge he, is... If he gets lucky with Wedge, he gets behind Wedge. If he destroys him, it'll be quite easy to go up for a while. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He's yeah. Going in that mind, he's it's still bear- thinking All right. he can go for it. All right, bear this in mind, he's still got torpedoes. You get two shots with the torpedoes. So this may be two four dice attacks. This may be hard. <laughs> he's Adam. Yeah, yeah, we're telly. <laughs> Yeah, this is this could be. I mean, you think that the, the sparkly rainbow fang fighter is? Uh, it's got a lot to do. <laughs> yeah, he's got a lot to do. He's using your target, yeah, yeah, yeah. Adam Adam Stevenson is actually a patron. Yeah, he's actually a patron. He he he, he, um, he also also helps design some of our old arts. Yeah, I'm not sure on that. I don't no, 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 he, first turn. Yeah, first turn again. Right. But like, with Wedge, you've either got a four dice torpedo or you've got a four dice at range one. So, I mean, if he's going, oh, range two, torpedoes. Range one, four dice. Either way, it's a four dice attack. It's going to be stupid. Because the way he had it... Yeah, and, and the, the way... Oh, look at that. Target lock. Look at that, that was terrible. Spend it. When you when you look at a game like this and you think to yourself, you know, it was quite evenly matched. You unfortunately it's it's one ace against three aces. So two evades, so it looks like he's taking a damage. Was it just one here, yeah? And it looks like that is it. Yeah, it's to 
Yeah, he's got he's got try he got his return shot trying to see if he can score some points. Fingers crossed. That's always harsh. Nope. Oh god. That's terrible. <laughs> you get last last to our roll, it's all blanks. Yeah. Damn it, damn it, damn it, damn it. Okay, well what I'll do, um I'll try yeah, so that's that's that, I mean, good game. All points go to uh, to the rebels there. Um, we'll just reset the stream and then uh, we'll be back for round two. Yeah, round two is at eleven fifty-five. What's time now? It's eighty-five minute round. Yeah, cause it's a ten minutes set up. So you got uh, just over an hour for round two. Um, we'll probably be in sporadically with do we get anybody else? But uh, but yeah. So, uh, do you want me to get them so you can talk to them? Yes. Right, okay. So, uh, uh, if you... Yeah, that's fine. That's fine. Right. So, I'm joined here by Adam Stevenson and... Andy Cameron. Okay. Now, you were in it. You're dice bird. You're green dice bird. Where did they go? They not, I don't know. I haven't really looking at it. Great dice. That's what worried me the most, um, you know, Luke gets taken out, which he did do. The only reason that I wasn't further behind was I got lucky with my green dice for Luke. But Luke, you know, Luke soaking that extra one or two damage. And he survived that extra two damage as well. That was the extra three extra Once in the game. He killed the shit. He killed the shit. He did twice. He did a lot of crap to him. He did a lot of crap to him today. He did a lot of crap to him. 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 He Swarm, which doesn't like bombs, um, and Ben uh, and Bob, uh, and their Jacku gunner, which doesn't really uh, like swarms. So, yeah, I'm, I'm kind of the, the bus list. Like, yeah, I'm tired of the bus. And it was more like, basically, how do we. Our, our problem with the bombs this time around. So it's been like Anthony, let's just take Anthony out with his favourite magic, you know, which struck me a little bit. This is a recent season with Yeah, so that would be new ones on our team. Three bombs. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Four of my ships. I've got two of them. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But in the world of the list, so you were coming to that woods session. Yeah, you were Ali. Alright, we'll see you at the end of the day, Ali. I'll put it with the Willies back. Thanks very much.